The Tustin Lighter Than Air Station was established in 1942, and after World War II, it was decommissioned in 1949. But then again, it was reactivated in support of the Korean War and was the country's first air facility developed solely for helicopter operation. During the Vietnam War, the Tustin Lighter Than Air Station served as a center for ongoing testing of radar installations, which were later shipped to Vietnam. By the early 1990s, the base remained a major center for Marine Corps helicopter aviation and radar operations on the Pacific Coast. In 1991, under the authority of the Base Realignment and Closure Act of 1990, known as the BRAC, in which I participated, it was announced that the Tustin base would be closed. Closure actually took place in 1999. However, the North Hangar is still used as a storage and repair center for commercial blimps. Now of the original 1,600 acres of the total base, 1,300 acres have been transferred to the control of the city of Tustin for the development of various public institutions and a combination of private, residential, and commercial land uses. The remaining 300 acres of the base ultimately will be conveyed to other federal agencies. Plans are in the works to convert 84 and a half acres surrounding the North Hangar into an Orange County Regional Park. Orange County Parks is in the process of gathering input and conducting economic feasibility studies to determine the ultimate features and layout of the future regional park. Two great landmarks on the base obviously are the blimp hangars from World War II. They are identical in dimensions, 1,072 feet long, 292 feet wide, and a whopping 192 feet tall. That's almost 19-story high ceilings. They are listed on the National Register of Historic Places and also designated National Historic Civil Engineering Landmarks. The two hangars were designed and built in 1942 by Holmes and Narver, constructors of engineers, for whom my uncle, George T.D. Ellison, was the chief financial officer. They are constructed of Oregon Douglas fir and are among the largest freestanding wooden structures in the world. This program is among the efforts recognized in the Lifetime Achievement Award from the President of the United States in 2015. Supplemental information on the history of the Orange County Park System is included in the California State University Fullerton Center for Oral and Public History. Interview number 2061 of Eric Jessen by Joanna Brand, published in 2008.